After integrating DailyBot with Discord, you'll be redirected to the homepage where you can activate your first check-in in any of your existing public channels. Now your first check-in is ready for use. On the homepage, you can find quick actions for your most important next steps at DailyBot. If you need to invite more members of your team, now's a good time to do it. Click Bring Your Team On Board to invite new people. You'll be taken to the Members page, where you can find all active users in your organization. Search people by their names to start activating users in DailyBot. In the home, you can also create new teams that will be useful to automate different things by roles. You can also refer back to this video when you're finished watching. And of course, you can see the pending tasks that you have for the day. In this example, the daily standup that we previously created for our team has already been filled out by two teammates. In the report view, you can see your team's mood, how many people have fill out your check-in report, if there are any blockers for the day, or if there are pending responses. The activity view lets you filter out the same report you have selected by either question or member, and you can export the filtered data or access your check-in settings in there too. The analytics view is where you get a summary of your check-in responses. DailyBot will automatically create graphs for you to see, if applicable. Kudos is the right place to give positive feedback or see the comments that have been given to you. There's a real-time leaderboard that you can filter by dates and teams, and you can export all this data whenever you need to. The received and given views collect all the kudos you've been involved with, and the Team Values view is where you can set the values that give direction to the feedback you all share. Forms is the right place if you're looking to collect data in the chat without constraints of frequency. And chat ops is where you can find built-in commands for your chat. You can also create your commands to trigger simple or complex actions from Discord. Here, for example, we created a vacation command that when triggered, will retrieve the form for vacation requests we previously showed you. And that's it for now. You've given your first steps on DailyBot.